A Central Florida staple for more than five decades now, the beloved Lil 500 go-karts is preparing to close its doors for good. The track has been open since 1968. News 6's Amanda Castro spoke to the owners and customers sad to see it go. The checkered flag is waving one last time as racers drive the final laps at the Lil 500 go-kart track in Seminole County. We heard that they were closing and I was like, there's no way that we're not going to go at least one more time. Shannon Crimmy brought her two sons to the tracks after learning the family business is closing nearly 54 years after it opened in 1968. The owner telling us the family is retiring and there was no one left to run the business. Crimmy says she felt like family at the small attraction. We would go to bigger theme parks with go-karts in them and it's overwhelming for the little kids. You know, it's a lot of a lot of people and here you can just jump right on, jump right off. There's three tracks, it's simple and they always take care of you. They Sarah Ridge grew up coming to the tracks. She's in town for the holidays and brought her four year old son Brendan to race. It was really sad to hear that something from my childhood was going so Glad we were able to come and, and Brendan got to, to ride around in the go-karts, relive a bit of my childhood. And that's what drove customers of all ages to Lil 500, wanting to get one last lap in. For Rice Glover, he wanted to make a new memory with his daughter. My wife was from here and she always told us when we moved back, she's like, oh, we used to go there all the time. And unfortunately, we haven't made it. But when I saw that they were closing, I wanted my daughter to experience it before it shut down. And even when the engines turn off for good, Drivers say they'll never forget the thrill of the race. Every time we come, we make, we take lots of pictures and we'll always remember it. Thanks for the ride. Woo! <laughs> As for what's next, the owner tells me that's still undecided, adding they haven't sold the property. The last chance for you to race is on Saturday. Reporting in Seminole County, Amanda Castro getting results, New 6. Okay, that Amanda, seems thank so you. soon. It is so soon, mm -hmm. but that is some good news that they haven't sold the property because maybe someone yeah. will come in You're and buy it. You're saying there's a chance mm -hmm. it will I'm remain. saying there's a chance. Um, <laughs> you know, because that was the first thing that we all thought, well, wow, it's kind of in a prime location. Yes. Yeah. You mm -hmm. know, maybe it's going to turn into some fast now, food place or you something. You know, and this is why you don't put off doing things because I've always wanted to go there mm -hmm. and right. you keep saying, oh, we'll do it another time. Mm -hmm. And now right. if you don't do it by Saturday, right. you may not get another chance. I know what you're doing Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> Only if you ladies will join me. Absolutely. All right, so as you can imagine, this has become a big talker uh, just across Central Florida and especially in our newsroom today. And it turns out, okay, let's get see. a wow. load of this crew. Uh, News 6 used to have a go-kart team at that track. Some of our veteran colleagues were part of the team. Wow. This was around the late 1990s. We weren't even WKMG then. We were actually WCPX. <laughs> That's tiny little car. Yeah, I was told we didn't end up winning this particular time. Quote, because the go-kart needed some repairs. Oh, what? <laughs> That's exactly why. That okay, so a, two people who are on that team mm -hmm. still work here. We understand that Mark Gruber, mm -hmm. who That's is... That's Mark right there, yeah. Yeah, yeah. and then Bob <laughs> Myers who's been here a thousand years. And can the do everything. <laughs> has done everything for real. That is so... And we were saying we don't do team things like that anymore. No, I think we need to start that up hey, again. We, we really have until should. Saturday to start a new go-kart team. I think there's um, all kinds of liability issues now that they didn't have back That's probably why we don't, yeah. Let's put Ginger in a go-kart. Why did you fun single me out? Well, okay. I'm a great driver. Tom, really have you been to Lil' 500 before? I never have, no. Oh, see? That's a shame. You we guys gotta go. We yeah. Saturday. It's a, it's a birthday party hit yeah. for kids. That's really good yeah. to know. That's mm -hmm. good to know.